Hey guys, I'm Megan Abel and today I'm going to be doing a video tutorial on how to do a, another variation of the aerial, which is the axe aerial. Okay? For starters, you need to be able to do a good cartwheel to be able to do a good aerial. Okay? Because all an aerial is is a cartwheel with no hand. If you cannot cartwheel already, I recommend you practice that before even attempting an aerial. Because an aerial should be clean and solid, it shouldn't be messy. Okay? If you're wanting to do the axe aerial, you need to have a solid aerial to start with. There are many different ways to do aerials, okay? A lot of people like to do ones which build momentum for the aerial. For example, the spin, the free cartwheel, which you take a few steps when you run into. But for this move, you should be able to do a standing aerial, which is. Okay, the reason for this is within the axe aerial, you will not be spinning, you will not be stepping, okay? You're using a setup from a swing, okay? The thing is with the axe aerial is it looks reasonably easy when you watch it, because you think, oh, it's just an aerial, but you swing your leg before. But it's actually really difficult because it's a completely different setup. So, the best way to start this is to practice to swing into a fast cartwheel, for example, Okay, if you can cartwheel, then you need to do it like this, okay? Okay? This gets you used to the way your body will be during the area, okay? As you do it, first of all, you need to know how to do a good swing, okay? This back leg swings up, back, for the momentum side of it, okay? If you just do this, you will not get any momentum. You need to swing the leg up. Momentum. This other leg will be jumping during it. Like that. Okay? This is so you get the height on the aerial rather than just going because you'll get no height. Okay? You'll have a really low aerial and you will not be able to get your body round to land. Here. So for this move, you will have to put them both together. You have to combine the two, the swing and the jump together to get round. So, like I've done previously, you can do it here. Cartwheel. That's how you start. Then you can either do it two ways. You can practice going into the cartwheel and taking your hands off midway. Okay? Or the opposite way around. You start with an aerial. If you feel you need to, you will put your hands down. Like that. Okay? As you do it, you make sure your hands don't touch the floor or they touch the floor later throughout. So each time you're getting closer to landing the area. Okay? When you put them together, the swing, the jump, you should be able to get round, okay? Don't have your arms out here because that will stop your momentum. Okay? I'm going to show you an example of how to do an axe aerial now. So from here, there. If you watch, I swing my leg quite high. Okay? It's not down here. It's reasonably mid. For this move, you need to make sure if you aerial this way, it's always the back leg that swings, not the front leg. Okay? The back leg swings through this way. If I aerial this way, back leg. Okay? I hope this video helped. Okay? Please subscribe to my team's channel, Team Pro at UK. And thank you for watching.